Are you tired of sucking at video games? Does it make you want to punch your monitor and break your really expensive keyboard? Do you die when you make that stress relieving balls itch? Then I've got a solution for you. Totally not using hacks. If you said yes to any of the following, then we can all go fuck ourselves. <laughs> Just kidding, fuck me. You bear the mark. You are cursed. You must taste your hand. Cool. Okay, so this is gonna be very quick, but in this video, we're going to not necessarily hack, but modify the game to our liking, to where we can get to 50 plus rounds and be okay. We can finally pack a punch this gun, this really shitty gun that we've always wanted to. JK, I don't know if you've really wanted to do that or not. Um, <laughs> but, yeah. I'm gonna make two videos of this, or two parts to this video. Um, one will be I'm just of me showing you how to hack, bitch. um, or modify this game, I, I should say more appropriately. And, uh, the other is going to just be the uh, straight, straight gameplay of, of how to get the box, um, and all the parts you need to get the box, etc. So anyways, let's get to it. So I have this paused. Um, now you're going to go ahead and want to open Cheat Engine. If you don't have Cheat Engine, um, I will provide a download link in the description so you can download Cheat Engine. This is a utility that will modify the hexadecimal values of the file or game that you are playing. So when you open up Cheat Engine, you're going to want to go ahead and hit this button. This is to select your process to give it a bit to load. And now do note that if you do not have a beefy or a beefy computer, this will take some time to do. Just uh, keep that in mind. Uh, go ahead and select Black Ops 3, hit open. Uh, I already have a list associated with this, but uh, I'm just going to hit no because I'm going to make a new set for the sake of this video. So we're going to just go to the game real quick. Uh, so we have eight shots. Eight shots. Take and take note of that number right there. However many you have, I have eight. I'm going to go ahead and type in eight. Hit first scan. This will take some time. Uh, like I said, it, depending on the specs of your computer. But once this completes its scan, you're going to go ahead and find eight. Uh, we're going to go back into the game. Shoot once. That brings it down to seven. You can already see the values that are changing. So go ahead and hit next scan after you type in seven. And notice that it, the number has decreased signific significantly. Now to refine the results, you can hit next scan again. Keep doing so. Um, go ahead and go back to game. Shoot again. Now you're at six. Rock on. Hit next scan. Keep doing this. Alrighty. Now, instead of doing it again, we can go ahead and save ourselves a couple of times and scroll down to where you see these green uh, hexadecimal values. Just go ahead and double click uh, the four that you have here, or however many you have. Uh, one of them didn't do it. Let's see, 147, so it's 152. Okay. We're going to go ahead and just lock these right here. Boom. Now, check this out. Yeah, don't get down in this round already. Alright, so that's. Uh, your ammo modification. The other thing I want to do is money. So we're at 930. We're going to pause this. And go here. Excuse me. I'm just a little bit sick. That's okay. Type in 930. Go ahead and hit new scan. First scan. i got to click that again. I keep forgetting about that. I do apologize. I do have a slight cold. But I'm not going to let that stop me from making this video. So we're just going to hit next scan. Uh, or new scan. Yeah, new scan. Next scan. Whatever. Find the results. Windows beep gets annoying. Yes. Shoot once, 940. Type in 940, next scan. Or, you know, whichever value you have. And there you have it. Now, the last time I did this, I did the green values of this. I'm just going to do this one more time just to try to refine this a little bit more. Go ahead and shoot uh, her one more time, 950. See, look at that. So not all of them changed. Next scan. So, I could just get the green ones, but I'm going to go ahead and hit uh, Control A. Highlight all of these values. Hit this little red arrow to drop them down here. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and change the value to 10,000. Now watch over here. You're gonna notice that 10,000 is gonna be added to. Oops, uh, my uh, my money that I have. I skipped one. That excuse me. I do not care of 10,000. I hope you guys are enjoying your holiday break. These are not changing. Son of a shit. We're gonna try these. Aha! So you only really needed two. And now they've changed. I just need to get in game. And you can see the ones that don't belong. Like, such as this one, you can go ahead and delete that. Out of here, you do not need that. Um, the, the ammo ones are fine. Uh, that's just there because of the 1060, right? Yeah. I'm still gonna get rid of that, though. Because we do not need that. Alright, we're also gonna go ahead and lock these as well. So this is for ammo and money. 
awesome, right? You can't have that relieving balls itch yet without ending the round. Sadly, we're getting down. I think that rhymed. We'll get to that next. So that's with Cheat Engine. The next hack is an extension of Cheat Engine, just more in depth with the value modification of this game. So I will provide, excuse me, a link in the description for this hack. Um, note that this will work with multiplayer and a campaign, but it is detectable and you will get caught. So I'm going to leave this for you to decide. Use at your own risk. I'm using this strictly for zombies. Um, and yes, for this video, I am using a cracked version of Black Ops 3. I do have the legit version of Black Ops 3 and Black Ops 2 in my Steam. Um, but rather than that, let's get to it. Okay. So you see you have your hotkeys, F1 through 5, and you can see what they do uh, to your stats and uh, the setup of your player. So we're going to go ahead and just hit all of them. I do apologize. I am talking really fast, but that's just because this is really easy and fun to do. Cool. We corrupted this world with their twisted so now we have become you God. You are Open this. You are we're going to get the curse. Hey, who the fuck is talking? Cool. Uh... That don't need that. Zap that. Get that. I think it broke. I think so. Go up these stairs. Over here. Now we want to jump down here. Zap that. Awesome. Oh, shit. Cool. We got that. Now watch. 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 He's gonna try to hit me. That shit is crazy. Those fuckers couldn't even touch me. Oh, they're touching you now, buddy. You got a lot of nerve, creep. Go ahead and get that summoning key. I'm gonna switch to my controller real quick. Oh, that is really bad. The delay. Okay. Um, insta kill. It's already insta kill. I don't need that. Do not get quick revive, as if you do not need that. Uh, <laughs> whenever I made my early recording of this video, I'm using Nvidia Shadow Play, which completely fucked it up. So. Uh, it was bad. Fumigator, sure. Go ahead and open this door. Cool, cool. Did I even open it? I did. Okay. So that's all for this video. In the next video, I will do some gameplay on how to do stuff and get box, of course, etc. And uh, build a civil protector and this really OP gun. That you'll see why in a bit. But Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, leave me a like. If you dislike it, dislike it. Leave me some feedback. Comment on what you thought. And as always, I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.